okay, not to be funny or anything. I may have created a problem with these because comfortable, I can integrate them easily into my style. So two down, who knows how many to go. Okay, it's another Ultra Boost DNA 5.0. Nothing insane or crazy. You have the prime knit upper for the sneaker itself that will wrap around the entire shoe. You have the TPU cage, which of course will provide the lacing system available. And if you look at the prime knit carefully, you can see we have some multicolor elements woven into the green pattern itself. Now, if you look at the tongue, it does have a 3M element, which is pretty cool in my opinion. Subtle, but nice. You have ivory laces that that come with the shoe no additional laces are available and we already know this shoe is made up of recycled materials it's part of the prime blue program for adidas to be more sustainable Flipping over, you have the Continental outsole that will encase full length boost, which gives the sneaker all of its comfort, but the torsion system helps with stability, but also arch support, which is something that I need. A comfortable pair and the colorway just hey it spoke to me couldn't get away from it and take a look at the on foot here so you're gonna get that 10 out of 10 comfort at least for me personally i love the athletic sportswear look for this pair and let's go to the actual fits themselves so on the left i'm wearing an american eagle it's considered actually airy it was a streetwear designed uh sweatshirt with the fear of god essentials runner shorts for sizing, most people go up a half size just because they are a little tighter to get on for some. All of these looks will feature a common theme, olive green bottoms or green of some sort. So in the middle look, you have the Adidas track pants with olive and black. You have the Supreme tee in red to complement the green of the rest of the look. Personally, an Ultra Boost looks great with track pants, so that'll probably be a go-to whether it's spring, fall, or winter, but you can certainly wear these with shorts or any number of things. I know some prefer to keep it more athleisure. They don't actually want to wear something this athletic with jeans, but you can still do it. Just do what works for you. Final look on the right, the Fear of God Essentials Buttercream T-shirt in a size small and the Richie Lee Collection cargo shorts that are also in a size small in the olive colorway with the Nike fitted in olive to top it all off. Be sure to comment your favorite look below and also comment what's your favorite athleisure sneaker to leave by the door. I surround my soul with the positivity. That's why I don't worry about the things that I don't see, yeah. These days I don't worry about much. I think we should have some more fun. I still dream about the days when we were young. I'll take it. What's going on, everybody? It's your girl TJ back. Another video on Talks with TJ and a little bit of a different format just because it's a Ultra Boost DNA 5.0. You've seen it, like a whole extensive breakdown when I got the Oreo or the Core Black in. So this was really just the, the follow up behind it. I really love the shoe, went over that most comfortable sneaker I own now in my collection. And the colorway, it just, it fits for me. And so you guys were able to see how I can easily incorporate that to be able to just dress it in a very relaxed fashion, perfect for summer, especially like those cooler summer evenings. Um, if you just wanna throw on like a lightweight hoodie and some shorts or just a t-shirt and shorts, any number of things and just, just keep it pushing, okay? You guys know me, I'm all about comfort and relaxation. I get the beauty of that in my life because <laughs> work from home and I really don't have reasons that I have to leave unless I need food and then Chipotle will see me okay other places see me too but you know Chipotle is bay next to eBay and Clay so this pair uh looking at it listen very happy very excited about this this is another pickup off eBay so I also see me getting my third ultra boost off of eBay. Now I need to force myself to break away from this olive just tone because if I don't, I'll end up buying the all olive pair. So maybe I need to just go for the navy pair. I don't necessarily know the all maroon pair, but the navy pair would be dope to have in the collection. And I had another pair very similar to this in the cart. It was the all green pair, but I went with these instead. And again, I think it was like 114 plus shipping. Yes, it goes through the authentication process because it's an Adidas pair and it was over a hundred dollars. And eBay, listen, 
fast process got it to me quickly and it was just it's a it's a great experience and i think that's why i like ebay and goat so much and shopping there if you ever have an issue you can easily get in contact with somebody so really big fan of that i'm a big fan of comfort this will get a lot of wear in the collection and quite honestly that's all i got so thanks for tuning into this video as always act your age not your shoe size peace